Christopher oh, hello, Reed. everyone. Hello. Hello. Sorry, I'm, I'm going to keep an eye on things because I'm still... Oh, camera's not there. Hold on a second. Oh! What did I think was going to happen? What did I think was going to happen? Uh, I, I fiddled a little bit with my mic settings, so hopefully it still sounds good. There I am. Hi, everyone. Oh, forgot to turn that on. <gasps> now I'm bright and fresh. Hello. Did you watch the 2020 Austri Austrian F1 race? I did not. <laughs> Too busy playing video games all the time. Uh, man, I gotta... I gotta figure out the glare situation in this room. We're in the, we're in the early afternoon. Which means that half of my monitor is, is no longer visible. But that's okay. Who needs it? I did see the sh uh, Shadow Warrior 3 teaser. That's awesome. I am very glad they're making a Shadow Warrior 3. Hey, Una. Thanks for the resub. You were playing video games while watching it. Oh. Shit. <laughs> I guess I could have done that. You sound higher, like volume-wise? I am closer to the mic. So there's probably going to be a lot more of my voice that comes through and a lot less of the surrounding room. I didn't have to dump... 20 decibels of gain on it anymore and then yeah uh you guys are you guys are up there now um since i uh i have upgraded to three count of three monitors oh frequency wise my voice just sounds higher i've heard people say that um i don't know that this is the case but it's possible that uh twitch is time scaling Sometimes when you first start watching a stream, Twitch will either compress uh, or dilate time to make it catch up to where the stream's at. So sometimes, sometimes things uh, sound high-pitched for a little bit, but it should settle out. What is this game? Um, this is a Souls-like made by some veterans of other studios. I think there's like, I can't remember the studios that came together to make it, but I did play Hellblade. Yeah, pistastic. <laughs> You're a pro bitch. That's fine. Everyone in chat is broke. Except for me. Cling to me. Yeah, uh... We've got a, uh... Yeah, this is very Prometheus, Prometheus looking, isn't it? Um, not quite Geiger vibes yet, but very much in the, uh... Disquieting body horror aspect of it. Ethan has two monitors, I only have one. Ouch! Yeah, you're not, you're not really hard computing until you have at least eight monitors. If you don't crawl inside a, a dome of monitors to protect yourself from inclement weather, you're not gaming right. Ah. Who it is? Okay, yeah. That's interesting. Block is just like making yourself, making yourself chonkity. Okay, well, oh, oh, Harden's on cooldown, okay. All right. What's up, Homerton? Welcome. Also, Ethan, thanks for the resub. You have Titan powers? Yeah. Here's something interesting. Here's something that, that only now is, is a weird occurrence now that I have a vertical monitor. Why is chat scrolling from the bottom up, but activity feeds go from the top down? It makes sense, but it also doesn't make sense. Need two ultra wides on their side at either end of your main screen. Yeah, also curved. I need them. I need. If you can't see monitors behind me, I don't have enough monitors. So, I'm still working on it. Yeah, I have a vertical monitor now, Jess. The, uh, my chat and activity feeds are on my vertical monitor, and, and my third monitor now just shows me uh, OBS, so I can actually see volume levels in real time, which should hopefully uh, mean that you guys won't have to deal with any massively blown out audio. That's kind of cool. Mixing like a counter mechanic in with with uh... okay, but it is on a cooldown though. That's going to be interesting. Harden while attacking. Okay, that's weird. I I did it. That didn't count it as being done though. Oh, you have to hold it. That's right. Huh. Okay. So you would attack, harden, take the hit, let go of harden, and then your attack would go through. Interesting. Closing premiere for the night. Time to grind MK11 and watch watch me play Mortal Shell. Maybe have a beer or two. Sounds like a great day. Sounds like the end of a great day. Harden mechanic is interesting. 
Uh, next damage taken while hardened is converted to health. Ah, oh, that's an interesting way to recover health. There's no free health. You actually have to like no attack timing and stuff. Oh, look at all this lore. Look at it. Use now more times to reveal further detail about this item. Oh, you get lore by using the items? Is this free? Uh, I mean, yeah, this this is an open beta. So it is available to all. All you have to do is... Sell your soul to the Epic Game Store, because that's the only place that has it right now. White monitors are expensive, but white paint is cheap. Did not expect, uh had to be so filled with with just raw knowledge and the attacks are pretty fast Ooh. okay can can enemies harden too or can they hatter crap you don't get a lot of you don't get a lot of time when you make somebody hit your harden Woo, okay oh Okay, interesting. Oh! Ooh! Oh boy, he's, he's working me. So wait, if you... I don't understand though. If, like, if you... If you bait out their Harden and, and you don't hit it, you don't really get anything for that. Jeez. Uh, like, there's no recovery, it doesn't seem like. And if I... Ah, well, okay. Maybe that maybe that was scripted death, you know? The beginning of a Souls-like, of course they're gonna whip your ass a little bit. Swing then harden? Yeah, I mean, you get you get one hit if you do it that way. It just feels like the, um... The risk-reward mechanic of that would make it... Seem like a little bit... Oh, yeah, I guess that's true, Vic. Then, they're, then you know their harden's on a cooldown, that's a good point. A Vesper hymn is not completed without the ringing of bell. Okay. Oh, that was a, that was a loading tooltip. I thought I just got that item. Never mind. This is an advanced copy. No, it is an open beta. <laughs> Everyone can play it. It's on the Epic Game Store. It is there right now. For you. Refresh towel. Yeah, the, uh, it actually, I think they put it out there on the 4th, but I was busy. Well, you could be giving out closed beta keys. You know what? Sure, yeah. Yes. Here's, here's, here's your first closed beta key for the open beta. B, write this down, B, 4, dash, B, 2, 2, 3, um, asterisk, uh, TM, 8, upside down 8, 4, dash 2. That's your closed beta key. That's their first closed beta key. Can you hear me? The tarnished seal enables you to parry enemy strikes. That's interesting. I would have assumed that the hard mechanic also is the parry mechanic, but it is not. All right. Empower repost. <laughs> Ryzen, don't just post it in chat. Then bots are going to get it. Jeez. So you appear to have infused with power, giving your parry the ability to leave an enemy vulnerable. All right. Resolve, tarnish such an infusion. Eh? Pouring in parry and then empower to repost. I guess resolve must be a, a resource or a bar. Gain enough resolve from attacking enemies to activate a powerful weapon ability. All righty. Okay, so we got meter. Interesting. Whoa. Oh. I wonder if... It said it would warn you about uh, un unparryable attacks. Okay, I'm guessing it'll like blink on your back or something like that. That's why it's so visible. When is Neo 2 supposed to come out? Didn't it already? I feel like it did. Oh, timing off. That's okay. Oh! Cool. Oh yeah, you're freaked out now, aren't you? Oh, that's a cool way to do enemy health. Ooh, ow.
Do you get health back for doing a repost? Yeah, it's Last of Us 2 now. <laughs> What's happening? Um, Huntar, thank you for the sub. Quarter of a year? It's pretty good. So wait, if I keep playing it, will I get better at it? Familiarity's going on up. He improved massively, man! From 1 to 2? This is, man, he's gonna be playing whole symphonies by the end of it. Yeah, pull that, pull that loot on out. Okay, hold on a second. See you no know, Wonderwall if I keep playing. Ooh. Ooh. That's a romantic little tune. <laughs> Thank you, Ryerson, for posting the link to the very closed exclusive early beta. Oops! Hardened a little bit. There's just something about whipping out that loot. Makes me hard. Come on, now like... Surely there was a meeting at whatever and they were like, Okay, people are gonna make jokes. Every single influencer, every shitty YouTube YouTuber group. May I wonder if I wonder if they do that shit on purpose. Ooh, we got a different song now. Like, let's just... Let's give the YouTubers an easy dunk, huh? Usually guitar players cast wet. Yeah. And wetten. Come on. I want that lore. Max familiarity. I do like how everything in this game looks really heavy. Okay, here we go. I also wonder what the player stats are. Like, how many people sit here and max out the guitar the second they can? Yeah, Jojo. I, technically, I didn't get the cyberpunk chair even though I'm sitting in it. Stephanie did, because she works for CDPR, so... But she, uh, she has another chair that she wants more than this one, so she gave this to me. This is how you unlock the bad ending? Yeah. <laughs> Already? Let me see. Pleasures in Falgrim are few, but the music from a simple lute serves to soothe man and beast alike. Oh wait, hold on. I need to go to the compendium. Oh, okay. I guess I got that... I got that quote. I do like the sort of, uh... Oh man, there's a lore tab. Fuck yeah. I do like that they're, they're like, collecting the flavor text like this because it does speak to awareness that all of your appreciation of the lore and the storytelling in a game like this is going to come from flavor text on items. Sif gave you her scraps? She did. And I'm lucky to have them. I'm going to run out of, uh, yeah, okay. Doing the parry actually gives you health back. That's cool. I like that mechanic. I like mechanics that encourage risk to, uh, for sustainability. I, I like the idea that a game system, if you are, if you're good enough at a game's mechanics, you can play sustainably, which is kind of neat. I like that a lot about Doom Eternal, incidentally. Wow, that was a crazy sound. The Vassal's figure appears noble in his pursuits. That's got a red background. That's pro cannot be used. This shell is unknown. Used four more times to reveal further detail about this item. Okay. So I gotta be in a different body to use that? Is that the idea? Hmm. The Perry Audio Crunches? Oh, sorry. Yeah, I, I actually did turn it up just a smidge, but I wasn't keeping an eye on it during uh, intense audio. Okay. 
okay. So you don't you don't get like a you don't get a frame one parry. If you were in the middle of an attack, you don't get a, an easy out really. Oh shit. You're 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 uh you're, you're parry. Oh shit, that does a lot of damage. Wow. Your uh your your yellow meter actually uh degrades if uh if you're not up past the pip, like you don't keep Oh! Interesting. You don't keep partial progress. What the heck? Oh! Neato! I got knocked out of my shell! Ow, and dead. I keep thinking, uh, I keep thinking you can have, you can interrupt animations with dodge. Which is usually how it works, but not in this game. Not in this game. You don't get to just dodge whenever you want. So that's interesting. I think people aren't gonna like that. Of feeling like you're trapped into attacks. Or that you can't just spam attack and then dodge roll if you need to. Yep, the first of what we presume to be many Fs. Uh, it doesn't seem like there's... I mean, I'm back in my shell, so it doesn't seem like there's horrific or long-lasting effects of... Ow. <laughs> Dying! <laughs> so I've been wandering right into that. I wonder if you can make them walk into it. I mean, he reset it. Yeah! Gosh, yeah, that you are slow in this game. What an interesting change. You're much more of a tank. Whoop. Yeah, I still have my loot. What if I ate this? I mean, a little more familiar with rotten food. It's not gonna make me throw up or anything. Not gonna make my tummy gurgle. Every single person I've been playing has stepped in that bear trap. I mean, it's exactly where you should, you would step in it. <laughs> they put it there so that you would step in it and then learn about bear traps. Might just be super slow due to the shell. That could be. Yeah, that could be. I mean, regardless, though, it's it's still a pretty... Uh, pretty daring design choice to put you in a really slow shell, even if it is related to the... Or if it is entirely dependent on the shell you're in. But that's cool, though. I like the... So it's like... Lips of futility is nearly opaque. Um, to some degree, I feel like that's that's the way that they can harder codify character build. In something like Dark Souls, you do your build, and it's kind of a soft build, and you can hybridize it between a lot of things. But that also makes it a little oh Christ, ow! Okay, that that's that must be the unparryable attack right there. Um, I feel like that that makes the balance a little loose because. They create this this RPG system for you to knock around in, and they create weapons and items and stuff for you to sort of build out your character how you want. But they they don't have many assurances, especially later in the game when you reach a boss, what your specs going to be like, what your abilities are, what your attacks are going to look like, um, just because of the variability of the game. So I oh that's interesting. They even show cooldowns on stuff. Uh, come here, come on. Yeah, the audio is really crispy. So I feel like um, by giving you explicit shells that have their own stats and behaviors, they can maybe a little little more closely fine-tuned difficulty curves and, and like boss attack animations. God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> it made me move forward. Uh, interesting. Oh, you get all your health back? That's generous. This gives me all my souls back. Ooh, ah, yeah, that one. Yeah, these animations are are intense, and the sound design is real good at selling the viciousness of this. You doing okay, bud? No. I Hope you're doing well, Doctor. Dr. Monster Anim- Dr. Monster Girl anime came out. Do I need to watch it and report my finds to you like Interspecies Reviewer? Uh, there's- there's another monster show? Hey, man, if you- if you want to watch- if you want to watch monster animes, you don't- you don't need my, uh, my blessing for that. I give you permission to, uh, to enjoy all the trash anime you want on your own time. In your own way. In 
inferior moonshine. Yeah, actually, probably. Don't feel like there's a lot of good booze here. Ooh. <sighs> Superior moonshine. A scripture of repent. A lot of interesting items here. A prayer of contrition. Hmm. Yeah, what is the anime called? This is an interesting way to do items, too. It just kind of puts them all in a use list for you. Okay, that didn't do... Maybe I wasn't looking at my health. I did, didn't put the prayer in. Yeah? Oh! Oh, okay. Never mind, there are quick slots. Next parry lights enemy on fire on success. Cool. Huh. That's like... Almost? Roguelike vibes? Of how using an item will reveal its, uh, its nature? So can you parry if you don't have meter? Or can you only just not... Ow! Can you only, uh, not do the... Repost. Repost! Who knows? Would it be possible that you came in the middle right? It's blocking some stuff. It would, but eh. Yeah, it is blocking the it is blocking the flavor text, isn't it? Well, this is theoretically why I have multiple Ah And it's gone. Who knows if it'll come back. Actually, wait, it's still got a little thing down there. Let's see if this is easy. See, it just throws everything else off. Just throws everything out. Oh, great. And it has moved every single window on my desktop. This is why, this is why I hate moving things around. I hate it. Okay, let's see if it'll stay. It probably won't, but let's see. Come back, nope. Ugh, oh, fuck. I was worried about this. Uh, now that I have multiple windows open on multiple monitors, and knowing, well, that's cool. That's cool. Knowing that Windows sometimes freaks out and, man, why did you ask that? Why did you ask me to move my webcam? Fuck. Rated R. Okay. Okay. Even though it said it was, uh, even though it said it was not full screen, it was. But now it's borderless, so it's behaving a lot better. Why, why in the, oh, I forgot about Harden, actually, completely forgot about it. I wonder if you get bonus meter for getting hit during Harden. Why did you lock onto that? <laughs> Go back. Don't worry, they'll be there later. I'm gonna have to use the restroom at some point. Oh! Oh, come on! Aw, oh, man. Ah. Uh. Well, time to use an unknown- Oh, I can't. That's right. What does this do? Glimpse into your shell when consumed. There. The power of mushroom will contradict the power of frog poison. Got your first job at the local museum? Steven, that's wonderful. That actually sounds like a really cool first job. Uh... What do you do? Or you do you just you just hanging out, hanging out at the gym? Or sorry, at the the museum? Uh, Zeradite, thanks for the sub. What is this game? It's a it's a new Souls like from some veteran devs of other studios whose names I don't explicitly remember at the moment. But it looks cool. Looks like it's got a neat old neat art style. The combat mechanics are a little they're interesting. They're different, which I think should count for something. That's weird. The chest is locked. Oh, okay. Yeah, museum is like a gym, but for culture. Oh, there's zone transitions. Interesting. Uh, 
Oh, cleaning artifacts and general maintenance. That sounds like a really cool, a really cool job. Um, and if you're lucky, you might get to skip. Oh, it, it, oh man, it erased my mushroom cooldown. Oh, whatever. Uh, if you're lucky, you may get to skip the the fun, the fun window of working retail and food service. You may not have to interact with complete piles of shit at work. Eager for another taste, foundling. Not so hasty. Not all places are as friendly. Really welcome, Ice Ice Man. There won't be any merriment around the bonfire. This is exactly the Dark Souls loading menu shamelessly stolen. Dead call this place it's a loading screen. <laughs> all that remains a lot of games have loading screens with tooltips on them. I don't think Dark Souls gets to claim that one. Like Jesus. Shamelessly world. stolen. It's a loading screen. Would you like another sip? <laughs> sure. Give me that. Shell's name to awaken its power. Okay. Uh, all right. I would like to do that. I have 250 tar. I would like to glimpse. Nope. Okay. Don't oh. overindulge. Try again. Must oh, okay. I guess you have to do that first. All right. How about shamelessly criticizing a game for being like Dark Souls? Well, the problem is Dark Souls didn't also invent that format, so... <laughs> Popularized it. That's kind of cool, though, that the recovery items, uh respawn in the same spot. Go back. Alright. Tell me why. Uh. Oh. You're going in for a server job at one of the bougie restaurants down in my town this week? I would say I hope that they tip, but man, it does seem like people are doubling down on not giving a shit about anyone else. You can unlock your husk's name. I was trying. I tried to, uh, tried to hit the buttons. It said you must discover the name first. Ooh. Or should I say, a distinct lack thereof. I mean, this character, though. Did you find him? I, I think probably aside from the the gameplay format and the aesthetic. Close. The fact that there are characters who level you up that speak in mysterious whispers like this is creatively exactly like Dark Souls. This character, even though aesthetically is not like the Firekeeper, is nearly creatively identical to the Firekeeper. So. I held A. Oh, you have to hold A. Okay. Would it please your withered lips to taste my gift? I, uh... I do... I have to admit... Um, I do, I do actively hate how so much UI is moving to holding buttons for no fucking reason. Why? Why can't I just hit A? Are they worried that I'll accidentally uh, upgrade my character? I don't know. Lost my job because of COVID. I actually managed to find a new and better job. Thanks for keeping me sane during, uh, with streams and VODs. Much love. Well, Telekineto, I'm very glad to hear that. Congratulations on the new job. The visage of a razor-thin line between existence and non-existence. And nothing in between. My upstate town has a lot of second home NYC people who have some money, so here's hoping they tip. Here's hoping, man. I've, uh, sometimes been amazed at the capacity of people with money to uh, want to keep it all for themselves all the time. How do you, so wait, how do you switch coils? Or shells, excuse me. Can you just... Huh! Okay, so yeah, they all have their they all have their own stats. I didn't want to do that. Menus are a little slow. There's a lot of animation you can't skip. Oh, okay. Hmm. So do I have to go? Do I have to go back to this this guy in the world? That's a that's a fun sound effect, and I don't know why. Ooh, a different kind of dodge. Okay, yeah this this one's faster. It comes out a lot faster. That is one of those don't pit people. Like, can he recognizes he's being a douche sometimes? 
And sometimes. Where you found Rogue? Oh, okay. No, so this is like the character select. Gotcha, Sin Gear. Thank you. Don't overindulge. You inhabit different bodies for different abilities and stats. It does seem like that, yeah. Um. Oh, now I don't have enough. Never mind. We'll go with, uh, we'll go what's his name for a little bit. Oh, Wimbly Tim. Get in here. You discovered the name of the Asa for 500 tar? You mean Teal? This guy? Oh, yeah. Ow. Oh, and I'm already poisoned. Again, the power of mushroom will save me. Oh. oh, you're newly employed. Why is everyone newly employed? I don't know. It's just one of the. It's one of those days, I guess. Everyone is waiting until the. Uh, I was waiting until the fourth to do all their hiring, their patriotic hiring. Uh, but we came as ducks. Thanks for the raid. Welcome. Have you bought Bloke? Thanks for the Prime. Kill him, Faulkner. Thanks for the Prime. Thank you, guys. It's because everyone lost their jobs. Yeah. Maybe this is what recovery looks like, even though it... <laughs> maybe maybe it doesn't exactly feel like that, but... Oh! Ooh! Ooh! Okay. This guy's serious. Some big whiffs on those attack. Big whiffs. Oh boy. Um. No. Damn it! No! Don't throw your head at me. He appeared in my dreams. This father. He revealed a bastion fashioned with stone by many hands, erected for the seedlings. In time, their burgeoning forms will outgrow its damned sanctuary. His followers flock all around us, but he withdraws. The workbench is his altar, where he prepares vestments of their faith. Am I blessed or damned to be chosen for this purpose? Ran out of air. <laughs> Didn't you set an item for the name? I don't know what that means. Get an item for the name. I I don't know. Maybe. God damn it, I can't see shit. <laughs> this game is so dark. And it's glaring in here. I can't see anything. I can't see a damn thing. Alright. I've got to like... No, don't do that! The, uh... Also, like, the... Fuck. There's a window... There's a window where it buffers your inputs, so if you mash, you'll end up rolling around like an idiot. Uh, Trey, I don't... I don't need a plush. I don't need a plush seal. I already got one. Thank you, though. I do not... Do, unfortunately, do not want my house... Filled with, with plush seals, as fun as that sounds. Oh, don't throw your head at me! I do like that they have a they have a suicide attack like that. Ooh. I don't know where I'm go I don't know where I'm going. This place is Ooh. Everyone needs a plush seal. I already have one. 
Just replace your windows with more monitors. Yeah, that way, if I have glare, then it'll just be another monitor. I'll be able to see even more. Connects to the hammer and chisel. Good God. But... Oh, never mind. Consumables, tar, glimpses. I guess these give you... I'm guessing those are like the sole items. Key items. The sweet smell wafting from this sensor hides a poisonous reaction within. The brothers use these burnt offerings to confuse and confound their senses. In a state of rapturous delirium, they behold obscene truths and righteous falsehoods. Very cool. Oh, hey, serotonin. Welcome. I'm, uh, I'm playing the world's darkest game in the world's lightest room. The first martyr gave neither blood nor body. No, he gave up so much more to preserve our faith. He gave us his living memory, all that he knew, all that he glimpsed, sealed within ice. As it thaws, open your mouth and harden your heart. Receive his gift. Remember what came before. We got big lore. We got big lore. Would a poster of Cain be better than a seal plush? Mmm. Ooh, that's a tough call. I think a plush cane would be better than a plush seal, but posters it starts to the value the value trade off gets a little dicey. Gonna watch from bed. Don't forget to push the buttons in order to make the things happen. You got it, Una. You got it. I will. You drop your tar when you die. Yeah, it looks like it. Um, I've died. I fully died once, and yeah, there was a little, a little pick uh, shiny thing where I died and gave me all my currency back. So far, it doesn't seem to be as environmentally trolly as souls. Oh, I already saw that one. So I came from this direction. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Well, I can't move. Um... I'm just here now. I can't use items. Oh, that, oh! I just noticed this. Uh, this this character only has like two pips for uh, counters and stuff. Can you leave your shell? The only thing that works is left left trigger. That's it. And I, I guess I can switch quick items. I can harden and switch quick items, and that's it. Nothing else does anything. Yeah. That's, uh, hmm. Okay, well. Escape doesn't do anything. Okay. Double dodge. It that doesn't do anything. <laughs> None of the buttons do anything. Um, I'll be right back. Ooh, baby, I'm back. Okay. Uh, broken reel. Thanks for the prime sub. It is, uh, <laughs> milk carton. Enemies beat the tar out of you. It is, it'll be interesting to see what, um... What significance Tar has. Also, I do like ice environments. So this mentioning of ice plus what you see in the, the men main menu is pretty pretty welcoming. Uh, I think it was 250 to wake up the other guy. I'll do that. See, it's all working out. Also, I got a I got a no, hold this bike. I thought I might have gotten one of the items I need to upgrade my, uh... Oh. Hello. Any weapons? Well, all right then. Hammer and chisel. Cool. Okay, I, I did get one of the items to upgrade this, I'm sure. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Okay, then maybe it didn't save. Here is a review of the Chonky... Seal plush slash pillow. My wife saw this being advertised in the book of faces. Book of faces? Oh, Facebook. And fell in love. She didn't think one would ever wind up in our home, but couldn't resist. Yes, we both fell hard for good advertising. It's not just a pillow that looks like an adorable seal. It's the ultimate chunky seal. If you don't get that, then don't waste your time. If you do understand how a chunky seal could complete your life, then by all means, be complete. No regrets. Well, shit. All right. I've been converted. I've suddenly been converted. This is something that stands to only improve my life, and I shouldn't be, uh, I shouldn't be, uh, refusing it. 
It's a single player online multiplayer. It's I'm pretty sure it's just single player. I don't know. Other people have been following this game a lot closer than I have. So I'm sure that there are people in chat who uh who want to get in there and answer that question more accurately than I can. It's broken just spam R1. It's it's certainly fast. Sip this and you'll Brigands pointed us toward the temple. Shunned by the devout, their allegiances lie to those who are fatah, or spirits. They entertain themselves with drunken antics or violent cruelties. They know better than to attack us. But they followed us at a distance, hoping for scraps. Yeah, Malcolm, you, you basically uh, summarized the entire chat. Trey loves seals, Ryzen loves Kane. Uh, ooh, nope. Boy, you hit the wrong bumper and you are, you are locked into a, a menu transition. Again, it's a beta. That's fine. All this is fine. Hmm. Wait. So wait, and there are like some items you have to eat that are obviously negative to get to get that delicious lore. What if I just eat the other one now? Bang. Lore acquired. That was easy. I like the other mushroom. Balance it out. No, I can read all that the mushroom lore. Where you at, mushroom lore? Oh, we. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just have to equip the right effigy for the right person. Whatever it does, maybe that's the thing where it takes you back to the um. The level up thing. Here we go. This is what it was for. This fungus offers a curious rush of nausea and delirium, often resulting in false visions. It's a convincing imitation of tar, though highly toxic. Then again, aren't we all full of pleasures? Or aren't all all of pleasures? Yeah, I guess that's true. That camera movement's pretty wild. I like that. So let's see. Cheap teal. What does the effigy of teal do? Summons teal through astral conversion. Oh! It just makes you the other... Oh! Well! 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 Oh, okay. You actually use it, though. Okay, so it is a consumable item. Hmm. I like it. I'm intrigued. I don't know what that number on the right is. Does that go away when I... Yeah? Hmm. Maybe that goes away when I die, or something? Power Ranger swap. Yeah. yeah, this game is all about doing shrooms, apparently. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Oh! Ow! Ouch! I thought I was supposed to be the big stamina boy. So you can just jump right back in your body, though. Right? Like, all the enemies stop attacking, and you can just walk right back up and hit A and get a full heal. That seems weird. It doesn't seem to cost me anything, either. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out some curtains or something <laughs> for those windows back there. Only for- only for the- the big gaming hours, alright. Ah, uh, yeah, come on. Is a man not safe when reading lore? Hey, Dr. Senor. Cuss gamer cred? God, you're right. Oh, wow, that's sick! He, like, pulls swords out of himself and throws them at you. Shit. So... Okay. So, kind of like Sekiro, you get to get knocked out of your... 
You get knocked out of your 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 body once. You get one. Yeah. Okay. How do you? What resets the one? There's no bonfire yet, so it's it's hard to figure out. You're awake. Good. Good. Please take this mask. Ah, there it is. Okay. It's not unlike my own. It reveals the way of all flesh. I believe it's getting kills. Ah. Beyond life. That would make a lot of sense. Where spirits pass across the threshold. Are you gonna go kill a red wagon? All right. I'll probably be. I'll probably be. Yeah, there's a seal back there already. Um, I'll probably be streaming for a while tonight. I missed yesterday and got started pretty late today, based on uh, some other things. Overlapping audio. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Ah. Uh, gosh. Everybody with their tech problems freaking me out. This is an open beta. It's open beta. Mmm. Damn it! Oh, man. Actually, stamina management is not simple. Okay, so it. I'm guessing. I'm guessing stamina is is so, so restricted to make you use harden. Like you can't just Dark Souls dodge your way through everything. You run out of stamina so fast. Oh, it's from Harden. What specifically is from Harden? If I had a Christmas wish, I know it'll never happen. But if I had one Christmas wish, it would be that people would speak in complete sentences in Twitch chat. I often see these, like, fragments of, of messages and I have no idea what it's relating to. Uh, so that's alright. This is my, my burden. This is this is the the future I asked for. Ow! Fuck! Okay, so you can counter without meter. Fuck. Also, you can harden. It seems like you can harden any time. <laughs> you like? Ooh! Ow! Oh shit! That's not good. So I guess. God damn it! What? What? Where was the counter there, bud? What's going on? Why don't I have it? You won't let me do it. I have meter. What's it? Can you not counter until you get your shell back? No? Still won't do it? Did it just stop? Not hard. I'm not. No, not, not hard and counter. Parry. Different mechanic. It doesn't have a cooldown, but now it's not working. I can't tell if that's a... I can't tell if that's a bug or not. I really want to be able to counter this guy, because he's very hard. Is that the meter at the bottom left? It is the yellow meter to, to, be able to, do a, to be able to do a counter. And usually you hit left bumper to make the thing come out, and nothing's happening. Hmm... Meets tied to special? I don't know. Is it from the same studio that made Dark Souls? It is not. That is a debut debut game from a different studio. I think uh, you ran out of counter. How can you do that? This and you. Is that a thing that happens? Oh, okay. Let's take glimpses. Still can't. I guess the, okay. The little the little white pip next to Harden looks like it's the it's the revive mechanic, but it still won't let me parry. Maybe I can't parry with this weapon. Maybe there's just no parrying with the hammer and chisel. Hold on. Nope. Parry's just broken. All right. 
We're just not parrying right now. Okay, well, I need parry, though. So... I guess I'll just reload the game again. Sometimes it just be like that. Okay, <laughs> back in a second. Hey oh Back, that was fast. Yeah, Cold Symmetry is the developer. Um, and I tried looking them up. And they have a website with like a recruiting link and stuff, but they don't really say where they're located or anything like that. Um, I think it's, I think their Wikipedia says they're like X Blizzard or something devs and X something devs, maybe Visceral, I, I can't remember. Or uh, it's a studio that made Jedi Fallen Order and Titanfall. I think there's some of those, some of those X's in it too. Yeah, there's that parry. Oh, we got parry now. X Madden devs, yeah. WWE 2K refugees. All right, bud. Ow, oh, eat you be chomping on me. You can't parry that. Shit. He actually still got me. <laughs> Bashed my head in the floor. Damn. Yeah, the stagger, the stagger mechanic in this game, I'm trying to figure out. It seems like a lot of attacks will stagger enemies. Cold Symmetry was formed two years ago by Andrew McLennan Murray, Anton Gonzalez, and Vitaly, Vitaly Bulgarov. Two worked as artists on some smaller games you know, such as Call of Duty and the upcoming Sony exclusive Ghost of Tsushima, movies like Alita Battle Angel. Mmm, okay. Team is quite small. Yeah. It looks good for how small the dev team is. The power of Unreal Engine. That's a fun little walk. A little walk cycle. Doop, 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 doop. Go into the market. All right. Nope, nope. Bad timing. Ooh. Ah. That is a deceptively fast stab he's got. There we go. Oh, come on! Could not even kill him before he threw his poison head at me. Uh oh. Oh, that's, that's staying on. Uh, I think it's about at equilibrium. Man, that poison sucks! <laughs> yeah, no, Asterix, it's... Ah! It's okay. I, uh, I, I am discovering the parry timing. It's alright. I will figure it out. I'm walking it off. Yeah, they, the, um... The timing windows for a lot of things in this game are... are they're not, they're not Sekiro, it's not FromSoft timing. It's not like Platinum Games timing. You have to be a little more, uh, a little more deliberate about what you do and when. God damn it. That's, that doesn't do any damage though, that's interesting. That does, that does a lot of damage. Ah, uh, wow. How you die fast. Dude. I can't. Bleh. Sip this. Okay. Spend hard. You don't Sangir, you don't have to tell me how to play the game. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. It's okay. It's, I promise it'll be okay. Ah! Yeah, Boost Guy, I can't see a lot either. It's weird though, like, also the reach of various weapons is a little hard to get a fix on sometimes. All right. Long wind up on that one. Thanks for the poison. Shit! God damn. Ah! 
just want to get past this fight without like losing my revive. Boy, one of these days I will. What is this death mechanic? Um, I mean, it's it's awfully similar to Sekiro. Uh, essentially, you don't over you get like smashed out of your um, shell. You get like pushed out of your body, um, and then you can you can hop back in, or I guess maybe move to another body or something like that. <laughs> What's up, blonde? Okay. All right. Yeah. I think I feel like you really have to get used to Harden. It looks very Soulsy. Yeah, it's, it's a it's a Souls like for sure. There's a couple of bits to it that are that are different. Um, obviously it remains to be seen. How much that matters? Shit. What? Oh, I still got poisoned. I guess the poison is around him, not specifically his head. Also, like... Okay, so... There's this... There's this red icon in the middle of my hardened meter that sometimes is lit up, and it, I guess that's the life recovery thing, where if I get hit while hardened, while that cooldown is up, then I'll regain life from that. Let's test it. Oh. I couldn't, I couldn't tell. Well, it's still lit up, though. God damn it. Fuck. I can't see! Ugh. Hmm. Resolve? Oh, maybe that's the, the yellow meter. Harden is a recharging ability? Yeah, it is. God damn it! <laughs> yeah, the timing on the parry is rough. Especially since, like, the enemies do troll you a little bit with the animations. And also, everything here, everything here poisons you. Ah. God, fighting two of these guys in an enclosed space really sucks. God damn. God damn. God damn. I can't unlock anything. I can't afford anything. These look like the vampires from the movie Priest. God, what a movie. What a film. Yeah, maybe I... I mean, it's possible that I shouldn't even be in here. Uh, Ranger Green, thanks for the cheer, man. Fuck. At least I got these mushrooms. I'd rather watch you play this game than play it myself. I'd rage and quit. I mean, if I can, if I can provide that service, that's not bad. Is this the only direction you can go? No, this is just the first like big cave that I found. So, it is possible I'm not even supposed to be here. God, it still poisoned me! Bleeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
Yeah, Shell Shock. That is a that is a sponsored game that I'll be playing a little bit later. Conqueror's Blade. Hey, come on! No. Fuck! Oh! Uh. I gotta love video games that just give you that, that special little fuck you. What if we had enemies that just poison your ass? Like you can't touch them without getting poisoned. Describe this game in terms I'll understand. Like those used when describing Raid Shadow Legends. Hmm. Well, have you thought of a game that's the most fun you can ever have? You might think I'm describing Raid Shadow Legends, but no. I'm actually describing... Ah, uh, Mortal Shell. So it's, it's almost as fun as Raid Shadow Legends. It would be as much fun as Raid if that were possible, but... I That is cool mo that is cool monster design though. I'll 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 accept that. I have a parry. Nope, that's not how we parry. And I'm already poisoned again. Everything fucking poisonous for us. Alright. When does the beta end? It's an open beta, so I don't know. Damn it! How is that so it's so impossible to see? I don't know why I keep- I'm out of mushrooms. God! Fuck! <sighs> Come on. Uh, the, the. No! How does he do the- It's like he knows. There. Fuck off. I still get a little health from that. It's wild to me that a, a parry does not kill these basic guys. Oi, okay. Ah! Fuck, and I used Harden too. Fuck! Damn it! I thought for sure I could get him that time. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die! Because. Is everything poisons you! Man! <laughs> uh, I guess you just have to- you just have to run away from those dudes once they pull their heads off. Hey, Raphael. Yeah, it's a cool looking game. Let your flesh see. Family. Ugh. No, this is not FromSoft. This is not. Pretty sure they're they're done with these kinds of games. That's the vibe I get. I think they're I think they're done with it. Get the feeling they'd like to move on. Oh car. Uh huh. Yep. Why not? Why not? Just poison my ass. I love it. More. Oi. Oi. Uh. Seems like, uh... Seems like that hammer staggers them pretty good. Sip this. And the thoughts on the AC Valhalla like footage? I didn't watch it. I don't know. This game looks kind of clunky. I mean, it depends... It depends... I think it's clunky because I'm playing it clunky. Uh... The timing windows are different. And I think that's going to make people say it's clunky. People are going to come at it tr and try to play it with the Rhythm of Souls game, and it's not going to work. And then they'll say the game's bad because the timing windows are, have shifted a little bit. I think it's a different kind of... it's a different kind of game. I think depending on whatever build you would use in Souls, it may make it more or less approachable. 
Missed the stat system big time in Sekiro. Yeah, the hype, I'm, does stats ever actually mean anything? Like, apart from, like, you can or can't use this gear, I feel like the stat system functionally doesn't end up necessarily meaning all that much in the game. Of just, like, maybe incremental more damage. Ugh, come on, man. Why can't I parry these dudes? God! It's impossible to see their <laughs> their hands! It's so dark in here. But they have two different attacks that come out at wildly different times. Okay. God! Oh, Okay. Yes, they did. Did they? Did they really? I think, uh... Like, the only thing, like... Doing more damage is not a small matter in a Souls game. Right, all it, I mean, it just... <sighs> stats only matter if it actually reduces the amount of hits that enemies take. So, like... Going from, like, four hits to three, or three hits to two is a big deal, but it's very... Oh, you can hear the sound difference? Okay, I'm not listening to the, to the sound cues. Maybe that'll help. Um, in my experience, uh, only when I was going back to an area that I'd been in, like, way at the previous part of the game, did it matter. Like, then I could go from, like, taking five hits to two to kill a dude. And improve dodges. Yeah, but none of it, like... So, yeah, you're talking about the, the effects of this. Oh my god! Three hits, are you serious? Um, that's something that can easily just be tied to something like character class, like it is in this game. Or like I assume it will be. Um... God. Oi. Not, that's right, I'm not using Harden again. These guys are gonna get me, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Man. Okay. I think I just gotta be more patient. I'm trying to get in there and mix it up too much. The amount of stamina you have is an important stat that is noticeable. Yeah. I I think more that, like, it is, but I I defy anyone, even Souls experts, in a blind test to, di to notice the difference of, like, two to three stamina. Maybe they could. Maybe they could. I don't know. I, I think... I think... Um, I like looking at, at pages full of numbers. So I get that. But I, I think a lot of the times people want that without... Like, they just want to see the numbers. Like, they don't... Um, they don't necessarily... Like, it doesn't actually mean anything for gameplay. Especially if you're playing on a specific build. Like, if, if you're following a build the internet told you... The stats, like, matter at that point? They kind of don't. It's there for a reason and you can. It's used in speedruns. Dude, you can <laughs> I'm talking about the average person's experience. There's no way something being viable in a speedrun means anything to somebody who's just playing for the first time. Maybe you're just speaking for yourself. Of course I'm just speaking for myself. How could I do anything but that? I'm just saying, next time you play an RPG, like, that has stats... Consider the actual gameplay implications of the stats that change. You'll find that, like, often they're not that important because they can't be. Uh, let's... What? No, it's still there. Okay, I think it was too late. No, shit. Get away. I shockingly didn't get poisoned. <laughs> I can be your power of attorney? Ooh. Finally. That's actually the long-term grift of streaming, is that I can assume power of eternity or power of attorney for everyone that uh for everyone that watches. I will say though that like in a Souls game when you upgrade your strength and you go from from, like, three hitting to two? Like, that makes a huge difference. Huge, huge difference. And, and, uh, that's, that's technically what the, uh, the whole idea is, is the trade-off. Like, what did you have to sacrifice to get that ability? 
It's meant to mirror real life gains. You don't really notice them day by day, but looking back, it's apparent. Yeah. I mean, that's... Oh, I forgot the buttons. That's the idea behind... I mean, it... Stats... Stats screens in games are entirely derivative from... Ah... Uh, pen and paper tabletop games. I... I have no mushrooms! <laughs> they have enemies that do dying poison attacks in an area that has nothing but hallways. Ah, uh, did these mushrooms regrow? They did. Okay. Oh boy, this might not... I might not... I think I might outlive it, maybe? <sighs> oh my god, I'm not gonna live! <laughs> Holy shit! Man! Alright, well, I got a little further, so I might as well keep pushing forward, I guess. This game looks fun, though. What is it? It's called Mortal Shell. That is uh, open beta on the Epic Game Store. God. The enemies in this game are ridiculous. Most game have a set cap where something becomes noticeable, like a faster animation from 15 to 16 and another at 20. Yeah. That way, I mean, and that way you can at least quantify the gameplay implications of it and then design around it. I have to use my head to block, block a glare. Oh, come on! They cover so much ground with their basic attacks. You're really never safe. If they're on screen, they're gonna fuck you up. Hmm? That was weird. Can they poison themselves? On a fresh cut? A little bit. Those familiar gain poison immunity damage for 120 seconds. But it, doesn't it also poison you? Okay. It does not, now that I'm familiar with it. Right. This guy. That's cool. Okay, yeah, and also the... The hammer can chain stagger if you have enough stamina. And nothing else is hitting you. Oh. Shit. I keep forgetting you have to hold it. It's a weird, a weird, like, thing to do in the middle of combat. Oh. I feel like I'm doing so little damage. Oh. <laughs> How long is the demo? I don't know. That's a good question. I guess we'll find out. We'll find out when this demo gets destroyed. Can you not go ham? Not really. The, atta the attacks are... Ah, oh, shit. The attacks come out pretty slow, and there's a significant recovery to all of them. That's about as fast as I can attack. And this is like the faster character. Uh, it's it's possible that I'll find faster... Uh, faster characters and faster weapons. God. He recovers so quickly. Shit. I can't, and also it's really hard to tell what's going to stagger and what's not. Oh, Amgram, thanks for the resub, dude. Oh. Ooh! He's going for it. Yeah. Oh, no! Wait, hold on. Maybe I can... Whew. Okay, that was close. <laughs> oh, my kingdom for a, a pleasing mushroom. And definitely not enemies. 
I don't want anything that will like. No! He's got blade hands! He's got blade hands! Ooh! Not him! No! No! Okay. <laughs> Ooh! Ooh, it's that Dark Souls feeling. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, classic death, right? I've kept your Edge of death. See one enemy you haven't seen before. Freak out and sprint right off a cliff. Oh yeah, M. Graham? That's good to hear. Yeah, that... The loot? I've used the... Wait. <laughs> Why did it do that? That was a suboptimal play, you're right. You're right. Severe swamp as. Thanks for the prime. And floopy duper. Thank you. Oh, Slenders, thanks for gifting out a sub. Am I maxing out my microphone? Um, when I yell into it, probably. Yes. I get uh, when I get up on that, get up on that souls, get that gamer energy flowing. Maybe I feel like part of me wants to work on parrying. Another part absolutely does not, because it's, it's very not safe. Unless you really know what you're doing, and I very much don't know what I'm doing. Bong Bopper 69, thanks for the sub. Uh, how's my day going? Pretty well. Pretty well. Had a kind of a relaxing morning. S doing some emails, having some business calls. Um, gonna be gonna be making some shill dollars later. After I destroy this video game, a pan flute would be better. I agree. Hey, Cyber. They send you guys those lovely chairs. Uh, sorta. Stephanie got this lovely chair by virtue of working at CDPR and basically arranging the uh, the campaign with Secret Lab. Um, so she got a chair, but she gave it to me because she's getting a more intense, more excellent, more beautiful gamer chair. Oh, God, God, come on! Please! Fuck. I have to run back. I have to run back. I took a hit and got poisoned. And now I like... Wait, where did the other... Where the poison mushroom? I can't remember where those spawned. Shit. Yes. Uh, who will I be shilling for? Conqueror's Blade. Which is actually a pretty fun free-to-play game. Uh, yeah, that's right. It's in the other square arena. All I have to do is beat five enemies in a row that have whack-ass timing without getting hit to get back to that room. Oh, c come on! Come on! You're vulnerable the second you come out of your dodge. The absolute second. Um. Uh. Ladies, be careful out there. Hey, Rocket Splinter, thank you for the cheer. And also, Jay Rickle, thank you. Engine Girl, thank you for the bit. Yes, we are in the middle of a hype train. Is that the Omega or the Titan? I don't know. I don't know the... the it didn't really say. It's whatever one doesn't have the lumbar knob. Ah, yeah! That's half my life! Ah, that's probably making the mic peek out. Maybe I should just do the souls thing. Let's let's see let's see if we can souls it. Ow! Ow! My dude kicked me in the back of the head. There's other mushrooms. Definitely want those. Oop. Oh, there's Blade Man. Oh, he's alright. Never mind, he's not alright. Ah. 
Oh! Alright. Can enemies follow you into a boss fight? Oh! Oh, okay. Oh! Oh! Woo! This music is, is hitting, though. Hey, Katarina, thanks for the raid. And the sub. Appreciate that. Are they... It's like some new new age pyramid head shit going on. Oh yeah. Boy, do they ever follow you into boss fights. Great. That's great. Maybe I can just leave then. It didn't seem like there was a fog wall or anything. If you press the menu button, you can avoid being hit. Damn, that is a top gamer tip. Oh, okay. I don't think you can... Yeah, you can't jump, so... I am locked in by a a ledge that is two and a half feet tall. Hmm. I wonder if I'll be able to do any damage to the boss at all. Yeah, this appears to be the first boss, or it, or not. Maybe I went the wrong way. Who knows, man? I want to find the tiny guy. Try and take out the small boys first. There you are. Nice and isolated. No problem. Fuck me! Can't move! That's concerning that uh, that enemies will follow you into the boss room. That means you can't just sprint past everybody. Or you can, and you just have to deal with it in the boss room. Which doesn't seem like the best place to do it. Maybe I should switch back to the sword? I don't know, man. Yeah, no fog doors. Nope. Man, I, like, I know that, that le like, legitimately in Souls games, usually multiple enemies are a serious problem, but holy crap, they're bad in this game. <sighs> okay. Did you get parry working? Yeah, I just, I had to quit the game and, and relaunch it. It was, it was a bug. But there it is, there's our, our big parry. Except, yeah, man, that... That meter drains real fast. You gotta keep moving. Also, I don't understand. When you when you harden and, and they like they back away like that, they back out of range. You can't hit them. You don't get a follow-up. I guess you have to be real close to them. Ay -ya. But then they recover well before your harden comes back. Ah. It's still, still poisoned me, and I don't. Okay, I do. Okay. <sighs> I'm excited for getting familiar with this welt cap. That'll probably help out quite a bit if it uh, <laughs> if it improves the healing. Yeah, that's right. He stays over there to make it extra impossible for you to close this distance without taking some kind of damage. McClippy, thanks for gifting five subs. He's not. Is he not dead? He's not dead.
This game is not out. This is a public beta. A public early access beta. Beta! Oop! Okay. Alright! Yeah, sure! No, we don't need to dodge. We'll just take those hits. That's fine. I swear that... Hold on a minute. Nope, maybe I should kill this guy first. Oh, I actually killed him before he pulled his own head off. Nice. All right. Uh. Uh. Hold on a second. I want to see. There, there was something about if if you did something and then you got hit, you would recover health while you were hardened. I thought. Sensor, sensor hold that connects to the hammer and chisel. Tarnished seal. Tarnished mask. Maybe not. Just don't get hit. Hit them a lot. Easy strats. Damn, those are easy strats. I, am I making that up? Has anyone else played this beta? Because that... there was a... There was an item at the beginning that was something like, if you use this and then harden, you'll get life back. Man, maybe not. Maybe not. Mortal token? Maybe, yeah. I guess I don't know what those do. I'm gonna go back and harvest those other mushrooms if they've respawned. The only thing was the parry, I thought. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I'm just making that up. Oh. Did I, did I do it? Oh, you have to hold it. You gotta hold it again. Oh, you UI. Ah. Okay. Well, that seems helpful. If I ever get enough resolve. Maybe it's one of those things where when you die, you lose it. Maybe? Some big weapon arts now. I'll try this out on the sword man's over here. Yeah, it seems like if you can pin them into a wall, do a do a nifty little wall combo. Does this game have backstabs? I don't think so. Twirls! That was neat. Do not fall! Off! <clears throat> Thanks. Thanks for that. Thank you. Thank you. And it's only the beta. Alright, come on. Yeah, cool twirl. Lost all that meter. Yeah, these are these are the real the real strats right here. Shove one of them into the corner and beat the hell out of it with a hammer. Dodge feels off to me. It's not a Dark Souls dodge. Um and I think that might be why it feels off. It's slower and more way more vulnerable. It's not meant to be your your damage damage dodging mechanic. I think they really mean for that to be hardened. Even though you can kind of use it that way. There was space over there. Give me that last familiarity. No, nope. okay. So sometimes it's not just 10 uses, it's like it scales. That's interesting. Oh, 
Boy, it would be great if you would hit anything, dude. Just anything. Just hit something. Instead of spinning in a circle, wasting every last ounce of stamina you have. Oi. What's happening? Oh. I'm getting chewed on. Where am I? Alright, okay. Oh, man. The, um... Boy. The, uh, the, um... It's weird, because you move forward when you attack. But you don't move forward nearly enough to make it useful in the situations where you would want it to be useful. But it is enough to mess you up. Sure. Like the, the way that the way that the enemies move and the distances they keep, they like they backdash out of your range all the time, but you're still well within their range. So it's like just the basic movement of the game is heavily tilted in favor of all the enemies, which can make it feel can make it feel frustrating. Oh boy, never mind. Hold on a second. Uh, somebody configured a bot and made it run way too often. They really, really want those signups. Uh, actually, wait, it's... Which bot is that? Oh, Stream Elements bot. Damn it. Yeah. Tell you what, I'll just make my own. Oh wait, how do you... <laughs> Thank you, Jay Rickle. Um, your own bot is pissing you off? No, it's not. It's just the timer's too short. Um, I usually prefer to take a lighter touch, but I didn't set that one up. Ah, whatever. It's fine, just for a day. Oh, thank you, MCARP. Yeah, in the future I'll just have to be like, I'll I'll set up the bot, it's alright. I'll take care of that. Why, why don't you let me handle that? Let me take that off your plate for you. Ah, ran out of stamina. Gah. I hate you so much. I hate you. How do combos work? Ah, oh, you just tap attack. And then you get combos, but it's uh, it's it's dangerous. You can't hit left bumper to cycle to the compendium. You gotta go to shells and let that animation play every time. Ah. Um, mm, 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 mm. Those familiar consume no stamina on their next dodge. Huh. Okay, that's kind of neat, I guess. sword poked in me now. Come over here. Okay. Ah. Ah. Fuck. Fuck! Man. You make one error in timing and you, you basically lose a life. Ah. Hmm. Uh. Much like real fights to the death, yeah. It's realistic. It's a realistic video game. Does Harden feel quick? Yeah, hard, Harden is like instant. Harden is like is like one frame, and and you're you can take one hit. So I, I do think Harden is supposed to be your survival mechanic, or your dodging mechanic, which is weird because dodging still kind of works the same way. Only the the uh, the startup is a lot longer, and you're definitely way more vulnerable for way longer after that. The attack animations are slow, kid. Uh, it is a it is a slower game. It's slower and the, the hits hurt a lot more too. 
believe it or not. Whoop! Alright. I like that... Like, out of everything, they actually decided to be a little chill about that not kill... Like, doing an ass load of damage and poisoning you. Yeah, these little guys, once, once you get them into a stun trap, that's not so bad. Yeah, I'm still trying to figure out this, like... So the lower left, there's like a little white ball of light that goes into there when I guess when you have a revive but I don't understand this like this icon or sometimes it's it's like lit up and it looks like a little bomb I don't know I think there's something I'm supposed to understand that I don't That's the other problem, it's like, if you hit left trigger a little bit before your cooldown is up, and then the cooldown's up, it won't harden you. You have to hit, like, that's happened a couple times where I'll, I'll harden, oh shit! Great. I'll harden and, and then my cooldown will pop, and I'll just eat a hit. Um, oh boy, this guy again. All my jokes are in love, nothing gets you your stream, I sure appreciate you streaming this. Oh, I didn't even see, I didn't even see your jokes! But, uh, I appreciate that. Either way. Thanks for clarifying. Sometimes... Sometimes when I... You know... It takes it takes a lot of bravery. <laughs> Hold on, I'll, I'll get through this without laughing, I swear. It takes a lot of bravery to be a streamer. You know? I'm up here... Up here, uh, gaming my heart out. Harden is actually a really interesting, interesting way, because it, like... It does give you the opportunity to sort of scout out new enemies. Having, like, a little bit of a safety net. You can, you can just hold Harden and see their attack and learn the timing of it. And, uh, without having to guess. Um, rare acid used to enhance weapons. Interesting. But yeah, I don't know, sometimes it can, can get a little unnerving. Being a being a, a brave streamer like me. Are there mimics? I haven't seen any yet, but can you hard mid-attack? Yes. You can harden any time. Um, so I, I feel like the hard mechanic is there to sort of take the edge off how much... Hmm. How much, like, startup and recovery there is for basically all the other animations. So, yeah, um, I don't know if there's like, so like now the little bomb thing is red. It's all lit up. Or maybe it's a little seed. I swear to God, there was a tutorial message that said something to the effect of when you take a hit while you're hardened, you'll recover some health. And I, I assumed it was linked to that, but maybe it's not. I don't know. Maybe I'm making it all up. Maybe life is one big mystery. And we're all, we're all just, just out here trying to figure out what's going on. Oh! He like teleported to me. Man. Oh, come on, man! Oh, I didn't even see him back there. Uh, uh. Uh, how long is the hardening animation? I think it's instant. I think. That visually, there is an aspect, like, he does kind of slow down and turn into stone, but... Um, I do think as long as you, you are holding left trigger... ...and the Harden effect is active, you won't take damage. It was a consumable that let you left or blocking with Harden. Oh, okay. So, I only got one of them, and it only worked once? Alright. So, what... Why is... What is that little icon on the bottom left, then? The little white ball, I think, is the fa is, like, the revive, but what's the... I don't know. It's gotta be something. That's the Sekiro soul? I, I mean, the white thing is the Sekiro soul. What's the, what's the little seed bomb looking thing that's grayed out right now? Ah. Half damage. One attack. Also, it's a grab. <laughs> 
The hardenometer. Ah! The red eye? It's not red. So... There's the red meter, there's the big circle, and then there's the little circle to the left of it. I'm pretty sure the little circle is the, is the shadows die twice. I'm pretty sure. It's red when you let you know you have resolve. Oh, okay. That makes... Okay. So it's like, you can do a counter when that thing's lit up. I guess that's a little easier than seeing... Looking down and seeing how many yellow dashes you have. The yellow bar. Right. Well, why would there be two indicators for that? That seems weird. Ugh. What's up, Undead Mesh? Welcome. I need, I need, I need mushrooms. It is also, uh, one could argue that the fact that healing items respawn on a timer is a, is a way that they can sort of offset the extreme damage that enemies do. One could argue that. What does this thing do? Spectral token. Oh, getting struck will harden will boost the damage of your next attack. Ah, that's neat. How far into the game am I? I have like 30 minutes maybe? I have I have I have run directly into a wall in this specific area because it is tough, tough, tough. I really like the idea of linking um Wow, I didn't know I was that low on life. Of linking um stat <laughs> oh, Holy fuck man! Holy fuck! Holy fuck! Just let me- give me a minute! Damn! They give you no time! I expected, like, some kind of grace period. Usually when you do a recovery move like that, it sends out a shockwave that staggers people. Wow, do you not get that in this game. Do you ever not get that? You jump back into that body and they are ready to get on, get on you. Ah. Also... The stagger animation I didn't have stamina. The stagger animation kind of looks like the animation for them winding up to hit you. So it's impossible to tell if you're like fun locking them or if they're about to stab your ass. Is all the healing consumable too? No flask analog. Not yet. No. I mean, the flask is the mushrooms. You can pick them up basically every time you spawn. I've kept your flesh safe. It's getting back in your body just for hardening? Sort of. I mean, you have... I think you have more stats and abilities that way. Oh. Cool. Well, that ought to help. Does spacing them work better than parry? What do you mean by spacing? Oh, you have more HP? Yeah. Oh boy. We stream Dark Souls and Souls Likes? Yeah. Extensively. That's not all I play though. There, see? So like instead of instead of I, I guess the analog would be if I were playing this and it were a normal souls like, I would farm up some souls, I'd go back to the lady, I'd buy strength like one point at a time until I got to the point where I could like kill enemies in three hits instead of seven. Or you explore, you find the acid, you upgrade your weapon, and then you're at the same spot. I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't really know like what the... I, I It seems to me to be like most of the difference in, in the approach is percepted. Or I guess that in this instance you have to actually explore and, and empty out the dungeon and find the uh, <laughs> find the uh, find the particular item you need to upgrade. Okay, I didn't know that that cloud would also poison me. Well, that's something. 
So, not only do they throw their head at you, but they also leave behind a death cloud that if you walk through it... Man. Ugh. Is the hardening specific to the class you choose, or is there even a class system? There is. I, the class system is the body you're wearing, basically. Um, so, maybe I need to switch to the other, the other thing. Oh, that's right, you can buy upgrades for the individual classes, too. Uh, what? You just like sidestepped around me. That was actually a pretty slick move. Okay, just die already. Okay. It's nice with the stat systems to go 100% strength or decide to go 50 and 50 health. Very hard to balance though. Yeah, especially when you don't know the game. Uh, it can be a rough feeling to, uh, to get into an RPG and realize you may not have spec properly, but that's what respects are for. Yeah, the enemies, they, they, they're, di they're killing, or they're dying attack is to rip their own heads off and throw them at you. Which is pretty damn metal, really. All right. Nothing like pumping up a trash stat for your class, yeah. Piety. Or like trying to play like a miracle user in Souls and not getting any miracles until two-thirds through the game. Good stuff. Huh. If, if these guys came in like quick succession, it'd be a lot... I feel like that would change the texture of the game pretty significantly too. You got a lot of these tokens. They don't seem to drop that much. There's something behind me. Oy. And if you like... Oh, that's right, you can't- you don't kill them in one counter! I forgot! Oh! He tricked me! The fast one! Ah, I just... Damn it. Okay, hold on. Counters are garbage in this. They- they restore health. So they're useful for that. Um... But yeah, you you have to play so clean to get a counter token, and then you have to nail the timing to use it. And if you don't, you'll die. <laughs> like, because like the only reason you would counter is to restore health. So if you're trying to counter, you're probably low on health, which means if you miss the counter, you're going to die. That's just it's that's an interesting and, and maybe a little too lopsided of a of a risk reward mechanic. Yeah, I gotta go through him, I think. What is that? Oh, that's the boss. Okay, just waking up a little bit. Oh, 64 hoops. Thanks for the sub. M Carp, thank you. Oh, Halo Dudette, good to see you. Thank you for the 59 subs. Holy crap, that's a lot. Uh, and Venchenko Actual, thanks for the sub. Caption, Caption Gomer, thank you for the sub. Hmm. If the encounters were better, you'd end up falling into the issue Dark Souls 1 had. What's that? Where, like, if you just know the timing, you... You basically just invalidate the game? Oh! I tried for the counter. He got me instantly. INSTANTLY! got a counter but it didn't matter like I guess it does it does damage that's a thing okay
counters forever, basically instant win once you've got them down. Not in this game. You don't get in you don't get infinite counters in this game. You gotta earn them. Oh shit, that's unblockable! Ah, yeah. No, we need. No, 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 go, 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 go! It was a mistake. I'm sorry, don't get mad! <laughs> this is so stupid. Oh shit, he's running. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> Good. God, he takes forever to do anything. Uh. This is this is silly because you have to like. You could wait for like five minutes to try and get your life back, and then it's just going to disappear the second you take one hit. <laughs> Alright. Oh shit. <sighs> like, that's, that's what's hard to figure out. Um, you have your special. Yeah. I am a hundred percent convinced. You're not, you're not like, stop eating the mic. You can see where I'm at. I'm not eating the mic. Almighty Echo, how about you balance the audio for me? You do that for me. And then I'll, and then I'll, the, uh, the mic will stop overloading. Um, I don't, un uh, I'll have to figure out the way that like, I'll have to figure out the way that, um, staggering works. Cause, uh... Ooh. Some, some enemies you can just run it out. Man. What? What? Absolutely rude. Alright, I'm just I'll gonna run to the you. boss uh, at this point. I see. I'm just blowing out when you yell. Yeah, there, there's really no way around that. Um, shut up. Seek this there. and you'll see. May I ask what the new setup's for? I got more monitors. More. Now I can see I can see the status of the stream in real time. Ironically, I can uh, it's just a way to get a little boost, that's all. That was a cool get-up animation. Um, it was mostly to watch audio levels, ironically. But also, by rearranging my desk, I was able to move my mic a lot closer to my face. So, that does make me more present, but also means that it's going to blow out a little more when I yell. Because it's... The volume, the volume levels are just much more erratic. Oh, okay. I was unseem aware if you can just run through them like that. I mean, they're gonna they're, they're gonna follow me. I think they'll come into the boss room. I can't. Yeah. yeah. can't tell when he's done attacking. What the? Like, summon icicles? Interesting. 
Why do I have a... I got like a little running man status effect. Hmm. I don't have any more of those. Okay. Uh, D. Hargrove. It's, uh, you can get it from the Epic Game Store. The hell? What? I was trying to do my super attack. Well, I can do it now, I guess. Oh, I must have I must have just been left bumper that it registered. Yeah. Alright, well, you're still not okay. You hit me going into the dodge and I came out of it. Hurt. Interesting. Dude! Do the super! He won't do it! Maybe the buttons are messing up again. Or maybe you have to hit? Maybe you have to connect with it? Or it doesn't count? It won't do the animation? <laughs> don't... Undead, don't, uh, don't listen to Ryzen. He's just gonna tell you to, to only look up Kane. need two pips of yellow for super? Oh, okay. Ooh, uh. So it seems like after his big jump, that's a pretty safe one to follow up on. That doesn't seem so bad. Like, uh, you actually, actually do a lot of damage to that boss. A shocking amount of damage <laughs> for the way the rest of this game works. Oh, man. It's so bright. It's so I bright. Your flesh safe, I think it may also be the time of year. I think the sun is getting more and more, like, to where it's just streaming directly through the window and scattering everywhere in here. I love it. It's actually kind of fun to let that dude boot you in the head. Oh, yeah. I guess the boss doesn't really poison you. These are not as... There was an item there. What's up, Yummy? Hello. A good way to start. It almost implies that, like, they'll put other bodies in the game based on, like, other people that play. Oh. I... What? I, uh, yeah, I, I, like, I can't see the left half of my monitor right now, so... I kind of can't tell when I'm getting hit or why. Ugh. I actually think I might take a break and just tape something over that goddamn window, because it's... Legitimately driving me insane. Yeah, that seems like a pretty, a pretty safe thing to, uh... To wait for. Throw the monitor out the window? Ooh, not a, not a bad idea. Like, okay. Or maybe I can just like, maybe hang something up on my mic arm to block the... Hot radioactive burning sun. How does it feel to play? It's... 
it's slower. It's slower and more deliberate than Dark Souls. Dark Souls does, and, and specifically like Sekiro and Bloodborne, they do a couple of things that give you immediate control over what you're doing. Um, the the attacks are slower. There's a lot more vulnerability on the beginning and end. Um, the hard mechanic is supposed to be the catch-all for that. It doesn't really feel like it. Like you kind of have to adapt around it. What? Oh. I'm hit by a falling icicle. We've all been there. We've all been there. Like, I don't know why, but hitting him, hitting him after that particular harden does ass loads of damage. So maybe there's like a counter mechanic. So like, I was actually able to 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 harden on reaction there. So I feel like you do develop a sense for it, especially with bosses when you start to learn their timing a little more. Ah, I cannot see anything. It's just a mess of black. Dark, if you will. <sighs> Fight the sun? I have to. This is what Dark Souls was all about. It's like Dark Souls, but a couple of drinks in. A little bit, yeah. It's like playing drunk. It's like playing Drunk Souls. You gotta, like, think ahead a little more. Mistakes have, like, way gnarlier consequences. Ah. Can't see. Backing into a wall sucks for uh, spatial awareness. Oh, are those stock bear sounds? Oh! Great. I thought that was gonna be it. Man, okay, hold on. I gotta, I gotta go tape something over that window. Hold on a second. Okay. Oh my God, you guys. Oh my God. I can actually, I can actually see everything. This is so weird. Oh, hmm. I wonder. I wonder. Hold on a second. Let me check something here. Let me, let me, let me, let me click on this. Let me click on this right here. Is it? Um, I might need to do that. Yeah, wait. Hmm. Yeah, no, I can actually see the whole monitor now. I'm just wondering if like, if the co the black levels are off on the capture card. Yeah, no. Well, that certainly le looks a lot. A lot cleaner. Alright. I'll leave it like that for now. I might change it back later. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, you guys. This game is visible now. Holy crap. Look at all these things I can see. <laughs> Looks washed out on, on stream. Okay. Oops. Can't pause the game. Hold on a second. Okay, if it looks washed out, then then yeah, the, the black levels are wrong. Ah, it's not, it's not a big deal to change it back. Oh, that wasn't an item, it was a candle. Alright, never mind. Or is it down here? Oh. Let's, let's do this fast. Okay! I don't know why the camera decided to yank to the left there. Rain Dog and Cro-Main. Thank you guys for the subs. Ow! Alright, this is gonna be a goof. Wow. It's interesting that he, he seems to have attacks sometimes that are specifically designed to fuck you up if you're dodging. I wonder if you can harden directly after dodge. What? 
What? Well, at least I got the super off. That's cool. Chromane, thank, thank you so much for gifting 10 subs. Oh. Mm. Your flesh safe, thank you for the sub bomb, though. I, I do appreciate that. It's okay. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get this. Going to get it. Going to get it. Just faster. I mean that it is it is a bizarre kindness of them to put the boss room within one stamina meter worth of sprint away. Yeah, squid of life. It's 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 pretty tough, but it just requires adjustment. I feel like it's it's not unfair. It's just different. Also, I feel like I feel like I got a free hit there. I uh, I took I took the hit from Harden, but then the next hit also didn't hurt me. So I wonder if you have like a little grace period after getting taking your first Harden hit. Oh, touching your shell uh, heals you too. Got me. God. Oh, okay. I forgot I had a. Wow. That, that attack comes out so fast, and I think does like 70% health. Hmm. It's about if I say this was made a decade ago. Not bad, just inaccurate. Do you remember what games looked like in 2010? Because they didn't look like this. Um, but I, I, maybe I think I know what you mean. It is, it is a sort of kind of grosser game, and they don't really make those anymore. It's a demo PC only, yeah. Is there an option for different characters with different abilities? Yes. You uh, you basically equip a different shell, which is like a different body. I guess there's characters who have like backstories and stuff, and uh, you equip them, and they basically change your your stats and your abilities. Your thingy lets you know that you cannot parry attacks, so it's a tell that it's coming. Does this mean you can parry some of his attacks? I mean, yeah, but I'm not going to. Uh, parry is just really really risky and not super worth it and plus you need meter to do it or you need meter to repost I guess I'll try it why not I'm dead I hit parry once and I died uh, touch the thing all right oh that's un unblockable Okay, well, I was... I thought <laughs> I, I was parrying there. Uh, Chromane, thank you thank you for the big-ass cheer. Well, you've been doing a no-damage speedrun of this game. Yeah, you're, you're looking at it. This is actually it. I actually haven't taken damage yet. Uh, I started playing this game, and I, I haven't gotten hit. Is there controller support? No. I've kept your flesh safe. Yes, there is. Downing. Yeah, maybe you just can't. Um, it also just doesn't seem like the right strat. It doesn't seem like a viable strat to parry him. The risk reward on a parry is, is so is, wow. Right. It's so it's so off. Um, it's it's useful in that it regenerates life, but you take so much damage all the time that regenerating life is almost like kind of a useless thing. Like you're either one hit, a, you're like two hits away from death or one. 
and risking a hit to get one of those hits back is just not worth it. Um, by by my accounting so far, but I'm also not a not a not a expert at this game. Crap. So I took my one hit. I think it might have been two, but I'll go touch touch my souls. Damn it. Ah have my I didn't have my thing if you don't have harden if you don't have harden when that happens you just get hit or maybe you just have to time the dodge perfectly that's probably it all right man What? Uh oh, maybe a uh, maybe a uh, icicle fell on me. Yeah, okay. I didn't even I didn't even see that. It was just a pop and then I fell over. I've kept your flesh safe. Wait, that slashed is that real? Yeah. Oh wait, never mind. There might have been any number of people. Yeah, icicle. Yeah, no, I'm there. I'm there. I like I, if I played it super, super safe. I feel like I kind of kick you out of the startup to, to the dodge. Um. Oh, Brazil's president. Oh, okay. Damn. No. Nobody should get it, but still, it'd be great. All right. I forgot to check the uh. Yeah, slash, dang it. Well, hey. I'm glad you said it and not me, but I'll go ahead and say, yeah, unfortunately it's not Trump, but... I'll get him next time. <laughs> shouldn't I shouldn't joke about those things. There are, well, you know what, actually, for him, it might be okay. Most people I would not wish that on. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, hmm. Okay, poisonous cloud chance of stamina instead of health on taking damage that sounds vital <laughs> to like have one-fifth of all your hits not kill you <laughs> ah, it's great every time I forgot to pick up the mushrooms again well whatever who needs them huh what if I just don't get hit <laughs> stupid boss Politics sucks. The thing is, like, it should have nothing to do with politics, Sevlak. It should have nothing to do with politics. It turns out that, uh... Not embroiling your country in a pandemic is actually apolitical. That should actually be something that no one wants to have happen. But it turns out that some people are just so goddamn stupid that... They just can't. They gotta have it. Talking about political figures sucks. That that is true. Dang it, he got down here. Oy. Okay, this is this just got a lot a lot spicier. Thanks. Already dead. Already. Wow, man. 
It's interesting that they'll they'll bop you out of your body and then stand on your body so you can't get close enough to climb back into it. Mm. <laughs> I've kept your flesh safe. Found. Music paired with the enemy character design is pure nightmare fuel. Yeah, I actually, I'm, I actually really enjoy the the presentation and the aesthetic of the game. Um, plenty, plenty of room in the world for souls likes of every flavor, and I'm, I'm super happy that other devs are taking swipes at the, uh, at the, at the concept. Took an arrow to the neck, or a sword to the neck, really. And then got chomped on. Ah, who cares? I have not finished Last of Us 2 yet. I don't- I'm not in a big rush to. It's like a TV series that I only kinda like. That's kinda how I feel about that game, so... I'll get back to it for the sake of topicality, even though topicality's well gone by now. Might as well go grab my stuff. Oh, there's no body there. <gasps> oh, if you're not in... Interesting. If you're not in your shell when you die, you don't get a corpse to, to touch. Interesting. I like how they trip sometimes. I think that's a that's an attack animation. Yeah. Hey, look at your teeny, teeny little health bar. Seeing it'll be a strap, but just running until he slips and attacking would be slow but possibly effective. Yeah, Squid, I mean, um, here, I'll, I'll just, I'll try playing the safest possible thing. Um, I'm getting antsy and I try to like, I try to get in there and like really have a, like a one fluid connected combo of hardens and dashes and stuff. But, um, no, there's, there's, there's a couple of attacks that are pretty safe, uh, that you can wait for. Um, a lot of them are, are pretty safe actually, if you harden through them. Stop getting cocky. It's not really a question of cockiness. I'm not trying to just win. I want to, like, figure out this, the, the game mechanics and stuff. Not to mention I could just back away um, and use mushrooms whenever I take a, 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 an hit. This game be playable while drunk? Sure. Everything's playable while drunk. Exactly, Shrub. I'm glad you got there at the same time. Chromane, though, thank you for the intense generosity. Just wanted to recognize that again. I appreciate that. That's weird. I got tar for some reason. This might be one of those cheese and weights, yeah. Maybe. I don't know, like you can beat dark you can beat souls likes that way, but it's not I feel like it's not that's not the point. I like I like being good at souls as opposed to just winning. And I know that like winning winning is good, no matter what. But it's fun to like really mix it up and get in there and like play it like Ninja Gaiden style basically. But yeah, I can like, if you just keep this distance from him and wait for an unblockable and then follow up on that like this, very, not that hard. Oh, okay. let's get hit by stray I uh, icicles, I guess. Ow, okay, never mind. Just on the edge of his range there. That's okay. Ah, uh, the the cooldown for Harden 
Always feels like it's just a little too long. Just a little bit too long. Wow. All right. Well, never mind. He worked me. Also, are they are they are the icicles targeted? Do they drop on you, or do they drop where you're standing? Because I feel like I feel like sometimes they don't drop anywhere near me, and sometimes they drop directly on me, like a mission, like it's it's their mission to do it. Oh my God! Wow. Leave me alone! Holy crap! All right. I didn't have Harden. There it is. I'm dodging too early. Never mind. Uh, yeah, I feel like it's only when you're gonna get a big hit in. Yeah. When you're about to win, the icicles will find you. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. I guess that's true. There's also a number of items I haven't even used. Do you have ranged attacks? No. I've kept your flesh safe, Balmain. Hey, what's up, Sixon? I mean, let me dink around with some of these items. I don't know that there's really all that much I haven't explored. There's this. It's not all that useful, really. Piece of equipment? Oh. Hmm. Bust loot on his ass. Yeah, I, I already, I already treated him to uh, to a few a few tunes. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, just need to play him the Gwent song. It seems like stamina comes back really quickly when you harden too, which is which is cool. Like that means that it's a mechanic for you to stay in on an enemy of using Harden to get your stamina back so you can keep attacking or dodge. Oh, Axial, I'm gonna head out? All right. Thank you for watching. Have a great night. What? Oh! He has an attack where he pulls his arm out of the ground. That's what killed me that other time. Did you guys eat? Did you guys see the timing on that Harden reef? Like the frame after I got hit, the Harden came back. But like the rhythm of his attacks, it he did it again. He got me with that shit. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to get too fancy. I'm trying to get too fancy. Um, that's a really cool death logo, though. Uh, yeah, the the cooldown on, on Harden is, is is very subtly trolly. It really feels like you should have Harden exactly when you don't. I've kept your flesh safe. <laughs> oh, you have another surgery tomorrow, Pop? Oh, that's right. It's what, your no your sinuses, I think? Woo! Hey, what's up, John G. Wentworth? Okay. Not gonna, not gonna, not gonna muck about anymore. I'm gonna be safe. I'm gonna wait for him to attack. I'm gonna use Harden, and then I'm just gonna bop him a couple times, and then back up. Boop. Oh, a follow-up attack. I don't. Jeez, man. He wasn't doing that before her <laughs> or it wasn't hitting me or something I don't know see like there's a follow-up attack that's exactly poised to get you okay so I just wasn't on the left side of his body ah uh, he does attacks in a specific rhythm so that if you dodge the first one the second one will hit you uh, 
I guess I guess you have to you have to dodge to the angle that the attack won't be. If that makes any sense. Or he'll just track you around the room. I don't have oh I thought I didn't have harden. It's so easy to Okay, I think I have to change the rhythm of my dodging. Because you... I don't understand, this was working before and now it's absolutely not. Now it's like, it's not working... by design. Where every time I dodge away, his attack perfectly covers the distance of a dodge and hits me exactly when the dodge is over. Man... Okay. Oh, loot box. Thank you for the thank you for the five subs. Is there is there a name for that like that like feeling that souls feeling where you like you you start to understand a boss's pattern, and then all of a sudden nothing works anymore? Yeah, Loof. Thanks for the thanks for the big pog, big sub pog there. <laughs> it's just called anger. Yeah, that's a good name for it. Oh, what the fuck, man? Dude. Oh, I'm, I've already gotten hit. holding left trigger what what was that that was mean weird maybe I don't know maybe the cooldown wasn't up who knows dude <laughs> he has a combo that does 80% of your health I, I hit I hit B. Why didn't I dodge? There's there's a, there's some stuff that's not really adding up right now. You can roll, you can, but you have to double tap dodge. It's not it's not the Dark Souls roll. Do not think about it like that. What's the disadvantage of the shell estate? Uh, you have like no hit points at all. I mean, it, you don't have any hit points to begin with. So also, if you're if you're in a shell when you die, you at least get a heal when you touch that shell later. Man, this is so weird. It's all falling apart. I thought I had his I thought I had his attacks down, but now everything's like lasting a little longer, reaching a little further. This is so strange. Just gotta spam that roll. I just told you it's not like Dark Souls. You do you do not have to spam that roll, in fact. It is not a Dark Souls roll. I mean, also it comes out after your dodge. It is not, it is not spammable either. Man. I hit, I hit right trigger. Or sorry, I hit left trigger. I'm dead. I hit left trigger thinking that I hit, that's two hits by the way. That was two. Two hits and I'm dead. Super dead. Man. You just can't get hit. That's all you gotta do. Just don't I get hit. Kept your flesh safe, seems like the game is getting harder. It seems like it, doesn't it? it feels like it. Alright. It's just weird. I feel like it wasn't it wasn't that difficult to get in and out before. But now he has all these attacks that are tracking my ass across the entire room. Oh, you know what? Yeah. Flave. I didn't. I unequipped the loot. 
and bring back the sun. Clearly that was helping. All right. Back away from the edge, so those monsters back up or something. Shit. Holy fuck, man. Like, you don't. You, his attack strings are too long. You can only harden through one or two of the attacks. I didn't, I didn't have it, yeah. Didn't have a body. Maybe it changes the way you fight based on your patterns? Maybe, I don't, maybe. I think I might have just been getting significantly lucky. What I was doing just so happened to work. Like, why did I even leave that there? Just a little wisp to remind you that you died bad. I saw a little, I saw a man's get down here. There you are, man's. Damn it. Okay, good, they're going around different ways. Can you hide in the middle of attacking? You can. Yes, you can. Which is a really cool mechanic. I actually really like that. Uh, it's just the timing is... Oh, I forgot. God, he pulls his arm out, and that hurts too. He does green sparkles sometimes, and I don't know what... I don't know what that's all about. Oh. Bro, really? Alright, hold on. Oh, you... Decides to kill you and then you die. Uh, and I don't get a heal now either because he killed my stupid body. All right. <laughs> oh. ah, great. Wow! 
Holy fuck, man. Stop it. You know, if you get hit by an icicle, you must be doing well. got a super. I'm gonna use her. I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna use it. Oh, the flash red means it's an, it's an unparryable attack. Didn't do it. I didn't do a lot of damage, did it? knocked me away, you know? That was nice. Give me a little distance. Eat a little, another little mushroom here. Alright. Hey. Is it gonna explode? Is, he gonna, is it like a bigger one going to climb out of his back? Is he going to materialize a giant icicle and fire it at me? Ugh. That was a crazy boss fight. Jeez. Solid ragdolls, though. And now for treasure! Oh, what? One trick. You killed the Grisha. Fine. Many died dragging that beast down here. <laughs> Thank you, extra stinky. As a slave, a guardian, that they would worship unfettered, enshrined in ice. Can you blame them? The perversity of living has always been its ever-changing nature. Cromaine, holy crap! So. Thanks for gifting 10 more subs. Would you like another sip? Next time you have anything repeated to tomato and tortellini. I'll get some goat cheese. And a preview. Sick! Well, that was fun. Um, it's It's got a different texture, for sure. And it takes some adjustment. Um, but I liked it. I'd like to see more of that. If for no other reason than like... One of the big things I enjoy about Souls games is that, as you play, you get to see crazy stuff. Like, it's, you just get to kind of live in their world. <laughs> so, are you gonna buy it? I mean, yeah, probably. I really liked that. Um, it, it had its moments, but, you know. <laughs> what would a Souls game be if it didn't didn't make a blood vessel pop in your eye every so often? Oh, but yeah, Chromaine, thank you for the... Thank you for the big pog energy. Uh, salty from what I saw. It's... I feel like... I'm still trying to determine what the what the just the, the perfect amount of salt is because you can't you can't be just like completely level right you gotta let some of it out gotta let some of it out you've beaten all the other Souls games I didn't beat Souls two but that's it I beat Souls one and three and Bloodborne and Sekiro uh, and Demon Souls I didn't I haven't played all the King's Fields um, I don't know how far back you want to throw it. Did you move apartment? No, uh, this is just a different, it's a, it's a different camera angle. Camera used to be there, and now it's there, so you get a little more of a three-quarter shot. Which is good, because I have a, uh, I have a wall of monitors now, and it's awesome. 
Uh, okay, I'll be... No, not not done for the night. Not not by a long shot. I'm going to take a quick break to eat something, but I'll be back with uh, with a different game. So I'll see you guys then. <laughs>